A Davenport thrift store catches the thief in the act, and this is caught on camera. Local 4 News obtained the surveillance video from Life's Little Treasures. Take a look for yourself. You can see a woman in a mask walk out of the store with a stolen jewelry box, among other things. The owner says she also took clothes into a dressing room and left wearing a different outfit. Police were notified about it. Local force Ryan Risky reports the owner thinks the thief won't be found because she was wearing a mask. We do have security cameras all over the store, and so we will get you on video if you come to our store and steal. Life's Little Treasures has caught many people on camera shoplifting from the store this year. Last weekend, they had another one where a woman walked out with a green jewelry box. Before leaving, she went into the dressing room with clothes and then came out wearing a different outfit. She did not purchase any items, but she did come up to the register after going into the dressing room. She was in here with a friend and was here for probably at least 45 minutes, but her friend went out to the car a half an hour before her and waited in the car. And so then once she did leave the store, she left in a hurry, got in the car, and they were really uh, pulled away before I had a chance to get their license number. Bowman says that she wants to get the word out to the community so they can keep an eye out in case the criminals make their way into other stores. It just seems like the criminals are getting a little bit more brave or brazen because of the masks and we want other business owners to be aware of what these people look like or who they are so they can be watching for them as well. Before March, if someone walked in wearing a face covering, it would be an immediate red flag. But now, with it being the new normal, it can be tough to identify if someone is up to no good. It is a little bit scary sometimes when somebody comes in and, and you're not sure who they are, you don't recognize them, and you don't even think you could uh, identify them if you needed to. So it is a little bit um, uh, concerning. In Davenport, Ryan Risky, Local 4 News. Ah, what a day, what a day, what a day. This is fall the way we want it. Let's